Hi, today I'm going to show you Yorin's ringless mermaid back carry. Uh, I've already got my baby on my back. Right now I'm holding her in a ruck, um, but I am going to do a sling pass. So for this carry, you need a base plus one. Uh, this wrap is just barely a base plus one for me. So uh, if you have a true base plus one, it will probably go a little better. I'm probably going to end up on my tippy tails for tying off, but just something to know. All right, so I've started off a little uneven. The middle marker is up here and it's going to end up right at my side. So the long tail is going under my arm for the sling pass. I'm going to make sure she has her seat silk. The short tail over my shoulder and I'm going to tuck that really tight between my knees. And then the pass under my arm. I'm going to go under the shoulder pass, all right, and then fold it over, pop in style, all right, spread it out, there we go, and I'm going to do a horizontal pass over my baby, Try to keep this tight, keep the tension in as much as I can. All right, so I've come over, and you want to keep this pass about the center of your chest. All right, now I'm going to switch the pass that came over. I'm going to hold between my knees. I'm going to pick up my original shoulder pass, cross it over the front. And over my opposite shoulder All right and then I'm gonna do another sling pass right. there we go. And actually we want a little bit of slack here in the front All right but not too much and I'm actually going to tuck it under her leg to hold it. If you could do over the knees, that'd be fine. Either way, it works. All right, so I'm going to pin it under her knee right here in the front, and then this horizontal pass, I'm going to spread out, try and bring all that tension back. Right? Take this looped pass, Go under the other side of the loop, right? Do another pop and fold over, right, spread it out, hold that. And I'm gonna do a leg belt. You could do another horizontal pass if you had room. Uh, I'm just gonna pull it around, try and keep it tight. You just do a leg belt over both her legs. There we go. Now I'm going to grab that pass I tucked under her knee earlier and bring it around. I've ended up slightly off center, but that's okay. Like I said, I'm tying on the tippy tails, but I could do a little bit of tightening here, clearly, and get a little more. Um, and that is Yorin's Ringless Mermaid. Now you can fix it so that it's more comfortable. Like I said, pull out a little bit of the slack. And then you're done. All right, good luck.